Just like, well, he kept doing it for the whole round, the whole game. Oh, yeah. No, I do that in this game, too. I When you're at the ledge with Mega Man, I'm just going to keep lemoning. Lemons? And leaf. leaves. Yeah, leaves. I just oh leave my so God. Oh, you remember that. Oh, <laughs> God. The nightmares of footstool leaves. I hate it. But, okay, so who we got? Oh, wait. <laughs> wait, so wait. Wait, so what's, what match is this? Um, is this? I think this is in losers right now. So they're just going to play them. The pools are pretty small. I think it's only eight people in a pool and four get out. So it's pretty uh, forgiving. Okay. Oh, uh, yeah, and I was talking to Jay Shaw. He said uh, there's no real... Um, uh, selection process here. If you feel like you want to be put on the stream, then you just go up to Jay Shaw, and he'll put any match on the stream. Yeah. We really don't. I, I mean, I guess aside from TSS, if you want to showcase some of the out-of-state talent against some of our best. Um, but other than that, this is basically just another FGF with larger pot. Yeah, buddy. And at a different venue. Look at that. Ooh, we got some nice lights in here. We do. Oh, man. If he was Corrin, he would have been able to Corrin. He <laughs> <laughs> He's not that Fire Emblem character. <laughs> No, he's he's <laughs> arguably the worst one out of the bunch. But he's got such a solid neutral. It's simple to pick up too, and it's really frustrating if you don't know you don't have an answer for it. I'm surprised Ghost still went to go charge that, even though you know he was soaring right above. He's like, you know what? I'm sticking with this. <laughs> and at this percent, I know that Ike is pretty heavy, and he's not particularly a fast faller, but he's he's not floaty either. So I think right now he's pretty good danger. Oh, no. He just jumped out of that mix-up, but he doesn't have a jump. Oh, wait, did he have a He did the mix-up way too late. I mean, once you see the up, you just roll over, shield, and then do the, the gyro. Seems like Big, Big Red's still reeling back, thinking this of Bayonetta. Is, is, and, <laughs> I'm so scared to go to that one. <laughs> yeah, I don't have much. You don't have much. Oh, no. my God. He's about to just raw dog it with that up smash, man. <laughs> he's about to give you a dog without no buns. Ooh. Oh, that's nice. He can do it again. He can do it again. Oh, we actually, I don't know. I think he saved him. Yeah, I no, you know, I'm on. I always think people snap on like so. I would have gone for the second one again. I definitely don't trust match mechanics for ledge grabbing, yeah. but I think what he did, he messed up. He got the soft spot of that because the first one has sent him much further. Oh, oh the jab yeah. lock! Oh, his play has gotten so much better with that. Gets that nice Full mistech. I, before he probably would have gyroed that mistech. Now he's going for for you know jab locks with up smashes. Going the optimal alpha round. Yeah. That's good. I like to see that because we see people, you know, who were, you know, who were kind of the middle of the pack in yep. Colorado, and then you see them improving a lot, a lot more, and not only improving their neutral, but just starting to optimize stuff. Now that they they understand the game, they're like, okay, now I can get this much. Yeah, it's Although, it. okay, I guess that works. Yeah, the people are picking up fighting game mechanics that didn't naturally happen in Smash. That's true. Like, as the game got more flushed out and people started to, like, play their characters more, they started to eventually understand this is a fighting game. And there's things that, you know, apply to all fighting games. Yeah, they're fun can. in, like, footsies, you know, <laughs> spacing. <laughs> Instead of just going in, like, this is my character's good move, I'm going to use Optimal it. damage, like... Resets, purpose, purposeful resets, like not even like jab, not even like jab lock resets, just like, you know, read the air dodge, uh, drop a combo on purpose, get an air dodge. Dude, I feel like American resets are so common. <laughs> <laughs> there's a reason it's named, that, you know, the American <laughs> reset. And if there's any game for an American reset to happen often, it's got to be Smash. It's oh, just yeah. To too much stuff happening. Especially on oh, doubles. Yeah, I don't even start. <laughs> okay, so it looks like. Um, and you, you can already see the way that he's playing differently. He's not. He doesn't even want to get close to Ganondorf. Why would you? Yeah, I think what happened last Ooh. time. Oh my God! Nice follow-up. Is that he? Oh my goodness! Wow. Just he knew it was coming. Yeah. He's catching Ghost in his trots and his run startups a lot. He's not walking. No, he's not. So he's going to get hit by a lot of projectiles if you don't walk. That's just the way it is. This game, you have to walk. It sucks. Yeah, and it uh, seems like Big Red's trying to, you know, show the stream, hey, man, Nero could do that to me, but I can do it back. <laughs> <laughs> Catches the jump. He's like, this is what happens with the tears. This is, there's a tier list for a reason. <laughs> oh, you oh and he's doing it. this? He's oh, going to get the punch? done. Man. He's got, I don't know why he thought his shield could handle anything he was about to throw out. Oh, yeah. I mean, just, just roll out of the way. Oh, I think he just misplaced that a bit. He's getting... He's getting what he wants, too. He's <laughs> catching these jumps. Now what he's got. Oh, oh he, he just, you know. You know. Oh, and he's going to hang on the ledge. He's going to, he wants that side B. Yo, that was an air dodge? 
I mean, a spot dodge in place? Yeah. It looked like they both did a move, though. Yeah, it was a... Um, no, he fell off the edge and went into free fall, but he's able to grab onto the ledge if you do it at a certain range. That was a pretty, pretty dope interaction there with the players in the gyro. Oh, my goodness. Oh. He's trying to jank him out, ladies and gentlemen. Such a... That, that was good awareness from Big Red. Yeah, yeah just when you thought he overextended. Oh, this is not a 50-50, though. You can, oh, it is still a 50-50, and he oh, yeah. guesses right. Oh, no, that... I was talking to TSS. Just assume it's a 50-50 unless you're at, like, 250. <laughs> what's, what's the mix-up? Beautiful choice, oh. but he got to get red. He had the option coverage for that. Hmm. For the most part, you want to go off to the side and then do it so that we can grab onto the ledge. And at that point, I would have... I would have tried to go off from the side, and then you know that he's going to try to go for that downer. So use your jump, you grab him, and take him down. So, But he had to use a jump to get off and do that up air, though. Did you think he didn't have to get that jump to... No, you can... Uh, you can he So you can drop off from the side yeah. of the ledge, or he dropped down instead of going off to the side and then using uh. the aerial. So he would have had a little bit more time. And since Ganondorf hangs the lowest to the ledge, he's able to do that. Just a, a little minor thing that ended up costing Because I know I played a really good... 